Hey, what's going on, everybody? I'm uh, President Barack Obama, and I'm standing out here in front of Common Thread, and I'm here to meet a very special guest by the name of uh, Reagan Farquhar. You may know him as a uh, bus driver. So uh, let's go in here and get a sewing lesson, and I'll see what's going on. Follow me. All right. Hey, Luca. How are you? Hey, bus. Oh, How are you? How's everything? Oh, man. What up, man? Hey, good to meet you, good brother. I see you're uh, reading a book I uh, studied for my election. You know what? I was picking up some tips. I was yeah. thinking about you. Yeah. Just yeah, right yeah. now. Oh, yeah? I was thinking, what would, what would Barry do? What would Barry do? You know, I actually got an iPhone app. What would he Barry gets to do? call me Barry because uh, only certain people. I, I, I know this guy. So uh, we go way back. I go back with his father. Man. <laughs> All right. So. It's incredible. It's an incredible book right there. I mean, hey, you want to get get by and stuff? Read this book right here. It got me elected. I, mean, I don't do this. I do this. I had no idea you're gonna be here, man. Oh man, you know I keep it 100. You know, so. Uh, <laughs> this is a trip. Yeah, I've been trip. getting your text, but uh, I've been so busy. Uh, you know, this uh, healthcare thing and everything. But you know. You look good too. You always look sharp. Hey, thank you, man. It's nice. Get up. You got yourself. Mom bro. always says sharpest. You know, man of color. On the planet, I'm Thank like, you. I always agree. Thank you. You know, you you have set the bar high. Thank you. you. Know? So now I gotta go out and go shopping. You know, I can't I, I can't really afford to do you, but I'm gonna do like a budget you. Well, you know, before I got elected, when Michelle did a little budget thing. You know, they did a little press thing. We only spent like a couple hundred dollars on clothes. I mean, now I got an unlimited budget. So, <laughs> hey, you know, let me uh, Armani. But maybe not Armani, maybe an American manufacturer, American apparel or something. You guys start making suits. And then, you know, it'll be all good. But uh, They make lawsuits from my hair. Yes, they make a lot of lawsuits, you know. I'm, I'm trying to avoid those in the White House. Tell me, how you been with your life, man? You got music on, Jelly Bean? Um, yeah, <laughs> put out a record. Okay. You know, trying to, uh, trying to make people get into other <laughs> kinds of output from... Black males. That's know? right. You know, instead of uh, all the normal riffraff, you know. Instead of instead of uh, politics and megalomania, I'm trying to do selfish, selfless rap music. That's nice. <laughs> Even though you know, I do enjoy a little young Jeezy. You shouldn't dig a little bit, don't you? I two step. Oh, you two That's pretty step. Pretty much okay. it. You know, I just I just do this all night. And then and try to look cool, hold my little non-alcoholic drink. And you got you got your uh, you do your dance routines on stage, don't you? You have a little routine. And, uh, I wish it was a dance routine. It's more like a seizure. Oh, okay. Yeah. Mine is all the single ladies. You know, I, all the single ladies. You get that going. You saw me on Ellen. I can bust a little move. Yeah. I did. Yeah. I'm, there. I'm glad you didn't give them too much. Yeah, I'll just give them a little bit. You know. Because yeah. if you give them too much, they put you in that box. Oh yeah, this box. Dancing president. <laughs> You know, I, I think it would be a good idea if we get like a Project Globe logo like sewn in like a patch like right here so you can, you know, when you're doing press conferences, you know. You oh, can I can represent like, Project Globe. Yeah, exactly. yeah, yeah. You know, Project Globe is the only uh, one of the first positive movements in South Central. We need some stimulus money, B.O. Stimulus package, I know, but uh, Chase got at me first. You know, I got to take care of Chase. You know, they wouldn't let me get in there. See, I'll take care of that first, you know. You gotta, there you go. Again. And, then, and then, then we can help with the younger, you know, grassroots movement, you know. So, let's get them off my, because, you know, I'm walking on the thinnest sides ever. So, <laughs> I'll make any mistake and it's done. We need to build, Barry. Definitely. Tell you. Let's build. To... Let's build, That's man. My boy right your, next, your next project, I'm definitely on it. I'm going to give the intro and uh, give the State of the Union. <laughs> Uh, the bus driver project. Yes. Or whatever. State of the Union on my album. That's, yeah. that's it. I think it's perfect. <laughs> so, uh, hey, is that uh, somebody to help us over there? We're going to uh, transition over for our sewing lesson because we got to make some progression and we can continue this conversation. Yeah, yeah. Right? yeah. Let's go. Let's do it. <laughs> All right. <laughs> hey, how you doing? Hi, Mr. President. Welcome. How you nice to meet you. This is Welcome. Reagan right here. Hi. This is Jen. So, uh, how do we get started? Yes, we're ready for you. Okay. Um, first, we're going to start out by cutting out these squares okay. and practicing our straight lines and curved lines and various um, basic techniques. Excited about that, right? 
get some sewing lessons. You know all about the straight lines. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I keep a straight and narrow, you know, or I would be elected. So uh, we're going to get this so, you know, our wives or significant others can have some gifts and a little help around the house, you know. Yeah, well, it's yeah. It's about change. I guess. <laughs> okay, first I'm going to show you how to cut. Yeah. There is actually a proper way to cut. Okay. And what you're going to do is lift up with one hand, but never hold up and cut. Okay. So you're going to lift up with one hand, put your scissors under, and guide. As you're driving, you always look ahead of the scissors instead yes. of at the scissors, okay? So you want to keep your scissors down and cut along the straight line. Look at that. That's perfect. And I'm sure you'll do a great <laughs> job too, Mr. President. Okay, oh, so try. go ahead and cut out all the squares. Okay. I'll let you do that one. Yeah, let me try to cut this. Because <laughs> she already started. All right, let's cut some of this, uh, some of Joe Biden's money. Cause he's acting a fool. Uh, cut some of this, uh, how about telling uh, certain people just to cut it on out? You know, right, right. Out. right. There very we go. Very good, very good. All right, I kind of messed up at the end, but hey, there we go. I did it. There we go. I'm impressed. Cut it a bit. That's a... Uh, a me? Yeah, let's see, let's see what you can do. Right. See, I'm trying to cut a little outside the box, Barry. You know, okay. I don't know if you know about that. You're a pretty outside the box person, though. You know, I've never seen the box, so. Oh, you don't know about the box? Hey, man, back in the 90s, when I wanted to see my favorite video, <laughs> I would go vote on the box. Did it? I cut there you something. Go. And it's, All right. I didn't do a good. I, there I we go. That's, I, I mean, this is great. I'm not a seamstress. Hey, but we're going to learn. You know, a seam stir. Uh, uh, right? It, well, is it yeah, a seam stir? Well, you okay. know, I always wanted to be a girl. Uh, this what? Is, is this for cutting dough? What's this about? <laughs> Jesus, look at this. Oh, uh, that's for cutting, yeah, yeah. If you, if you need to cut a little. Is like a baggie around right here? Yeah. <laughs> <Get some. laughs> oh, shit. Uh, everything right here is made in America, right? <laughs> First of all. All right. So I want you to show me what it feels like to be in a sweatshop. I'm just playing. I like to joke a little bit. That's it. So first, we're going to lay this piece down. And what you're going to do is put this under and follow that line, OK? Put this under, right? Yep. OK. And then you're going to put this foot lever down in the back, as you can see. OK. And you are going to press lightly on the pedal. Where is the pedal? On your right foot. Oh, okay. So, uh, you know, uh, I like to drive race cars, so uh, easy, right? Easy on the gas. Okay, okay. Easy on the gas at first. Make sure I don't stitch my finger up. That's right. So you want to keep your right hand here and your left hand here, and you are the driver. And no pulling and I'm, no I'm pushing. Driver. He's the driver. <laughs> He's the bus driver. And I'm, I'm, right. I'm copying you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. For rocks. I'm biting you. Yeah, well, stop biting me. What is this for? It's called a little snipper, so, so you basically, snip. exactly. So you snip the threads away. Okay, um, good, good, because, uh, yeah, I want to get one of these for mm -hmm. other, have other uses. It's definitely oh, useful when you're sewing. I like to trim my beard, or, you know, like trim a little bit of, you know. Actually, there's a slogan that comes with this. Yes. Um, Stop snitching or my snark snipping. So, so, snitch, I snip. Snip, snip, anyway. I've heard that before, you know, uh, stop snitching. It's pretty big. <laughs> it's pretty big right here. How you doing over there, driver? I'm just, I'm, I'm kind of awestruck, you know, like, like, like people, because I, I hire people to do this, and I don't realize <laughs> the kind of artistry that's involved. Okay. So I've underappreciated what goes into this. And, you know, I'm changing. This is changing, man. I'm getting one of these. I'm bringing it home. Hey, that was great, you know. You know, I'm, you know. I'm hooking up to my, my, my laptop. You know okay. I, mean? I know there's like a part, you know, I can sound like a PDF and you can sew it out. You know, I know, you know. I heard about that. It's like a, it's like a MIDI thing. Yeah, it's got a little, a little like USB out, so I'm, I'm, I'm going to Oh, okay. Up. And then you send the, and then you can stitch your, you can stitch your logo in there, right? Yeah, yeah. Actually, exactly. I can send this to MP3. You can, you know, stitch out the waveform of the song. That you know what I mean? That would be the best. So I'm just trying to, I'm trying to, you know, get this thing cracking. So. And you send like a Pro Tools file and, and stitch waveform to your producer, <laughs> then he can interpret it. This is incredible. Oh my God. 
Wait. Oh, that's right. That's the foot. Is it supposed to? Okay. The foot's supposed to slam down because a foot sometimes has to. You know, you got to put a foot in somebody's canister sometimes. You know, I'm trying to. Usually, uh, when there's no cameras, I'm a little bit, a little bit more French to my language, but you know, I'm trying to leave it unsalty right now. Man, I'm gonna get one of these. If you see these in the hood, don't trip. You know, it's just me going to work, letting people know what's up. No I'm, more I'm, snitching. I'm over at Common Threads, you know, getting all my homies the latest shanks, you know, stop snitching and start sniffing. Blog That's right. Yeah. Wow, oh my goodness. I was gone for a little while and look at what you guys made. Yeah. That is amazing. That's for my daughter right there. Hey, look at that right there. That look is beautiful. Size. You, you guys know. did such a great job. You guys are like pros. It's, hey, thank you very much. It's not a problem. You thank know. you. It was a great teacher. Well, you yes. Know. <laughs> you know, great teacher. It is credit to myself. Students. Yeah, all right. All right. Thank you very well, much, Well, you Jen. did a wonderful job. Thank you so much for coming into Common Thread. Thank you very much. And uh, Americans come down to Common Thread. <laughs> we'll learn how to make stuff like this. Uh, Dasha, I hope you like this. If you uh, notice, my thing is a little bit more complicated and involved than it is. the rocks. You it is. You did have to match uh, up all the lines. You know, your, take extra your lyrics there. are more involved. You know, I, I'm a simple man. So just know. take note of that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So. Um, so, uh, hey, hey uh, Reagan, uh, Jim, thank you very much. Of course, you know, thank you, Mr. President, for thank coming Thank you very in. much. Uh, Reagan, thank you for coming down. Uh, I mean, you know, I just live right off the street. I just be on the corner usually. Okay. Uh, anything uh, before I head back to Washington? Uh, you want to go get a coffee and we catch up? You tell me a couple things. Man, man, you know what? You're messing up, man. I'm messing up. You need to get out of there, man. I, I saw the little debate where you're calling out, you know, the blue dogs and the right, and you're, you know, talking shit. It was good. It was good. I had to call them out, you know. But we need that on like a weekly basis. You know, you probably need to come down to the blow and like battle well, you, you, the you, senator. You, you forget that I'm walking on the thin ice, thinnest ice ever. If I start, you know, they're gonna start calling me a gangbanger. <laughs> you know, like I can't get, like, look at the wild president. The president's getting wild. You know. I, a little bit. I gotta give them a little bit. I can't shake up their cage too much, you know. Um, or I, they might put me in a cage. Well, then you need me. You need to hire me. Give me the administration. You know, Joe. I mean, you got. I mean, Joe's supposed to do that. Like, what's up with Joe Biden? Like, he and Facebook me the other day. Like, well, talk to Barry for me. Like, uh, that nigga don't even. You know, I like. Never talk to me. So I'm like. Joe. Joe's cool. You know, I, I hired Joe because he reminded me of uh, the bald eagle. You know. So I needed somebody American. I, you know, you got this black guy running for office. So I was trying to show him how American I was by hiring Joe Biden. He looks like the old school bald eagle. So uh, G.I. Joe too. You know, he has that look. He's old as senator, and he's, he's just comfortable. It just yeah. made people feel safe. Yeah, you know? well, he's 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 kind of hurting. You know, he is hurting. But uh, let's wrap this up. Let's talk. Let's get you a job. I'm gonna call Rom. Let's see what I can do for you. Let's it's go get me. this coffee. All right. <laughs> I'll make sure Rom gets you a job. Let's go. That's why. All right, thank you very much, Jen. Uh, get this to Sasha Malia. Hey, don't forget your uh, pillow right there. I'm having that sent to my house. Oh, okay. I'm giving this delivered hand. Thank you very much, uh, Common Thread. Of course, so, thank uh, you. Let's talk about this uh, thing here. Uh, I'm just saying, like, you gotta, you gotta open your heart and open your mind. Yeah, my heart, my heart is open. Heart, mind, oh, mind. Oh, my heart too much. They might want to open my ass up. <laughs> <laughs> You have anything to say add to that? Um, I can't top that. You know, I'm just, you know, I'm just a humble servant. You know? Cool. I'm bringing that down the blow. You guys better watch out, cause I'm uh, taking heads. Well, there's no one at the blow, so. Oh, what, what, there's no one there. Damn. Okay. I, I, I need an update. Uh, let's go find out. Let's go get some people down there now. Uh, <laughs> They're on the unemployment line. You know. <laughs> Well, let's all get them some jobs. I got you a job. You and I told, give me a job. I told uh, Eddie I was going to get him a job, too. Right, so he's got a job. Let's get you a job. Let's go. <laughs> <Thank you. laughs>